right, what's up, what's up, what's up, what's up? This is uh, King Bach. You are now rocking with the Drinks and Discussion podcast. I got uh, I got my my co-host with me, Miss V. You forget me? Nah, I ain't forget you. I just want to <laughs> say my dad had poppy shit this time, but I did. So <laughs> his dad had poppy in the Rewind. building. Look, I am, I, I am um I am retiring Bandana Sanchez. He get too serious, so his dad had poppy right now. Okay. Next, Welcome. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm going to think of something for my tent fade. Because, you know, I get the tent fade. I'm, I'm going to think of something for that. Okay. I got my... I got. We got a guest with us today. Yes. We got a guest with us today. This has been my homeboy for God knows how long. College. Co- college oh, freshman year? Yeah. Was it freshman year? Yeah. God almighty. Oh, six. <laughs> Bro, we old as hell. Somebody old. We ain't old. Plus. I, don't look old. I don't know about you. I'm not in the old category. Hey, bro. man, look. This beard made me look a little older, man. But that's about it. You yeah. know, I ain't had this beard back then. I'm, I'm baby face gangster. You know, hey, man, look. Ain't always. nothing wrong with that. Ain't Everybody got aliases. <laughs> oh, no. He had, he had the best alias in 06. <laughs> you know what the alias was? <laughs> Bow Wow. He had the straight back cornrows and everything. You definitely have cornrows. <laughs> no, so oh, I man. thought I was locking it for a second, but nah. Nah, nah it won't happen. It. Mm-hmm. I couldn't see you with like you, you know what, bro? If you got locks, you would look like uh like 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 Terrence from um from Empire. How it was, <laughs> bro, if you would have got locks, that's how I felt like you would have looked. <laughs> oh wow. Okay. No, but no. I'll take that. No. But look, from the from the from the braids to the close cut, yo, bro, I've I've seen it all. I've seen the entire transition. So Definitely. hey look, bro, you always been a smooth cat. I get my style from you, man. I appreciate it. Oh yeah. I appreciate it. Well, go know. ahead and introduce yourself for the people, man. We just be talking. K Huff, <laughs> Mr. Impost, Mr. Wake Up and Earn Sign. Get at me. Holla at your boy. And he uh he actually sponsored the shirts we got on today, Wake yeah. Up and Earn Something. So, you know. Make sure you check my man's out, man. I'm gonna put his uh, I'm gonna put his uh, Instagram and everything in the bio, man. So make sure y'all check him out, man. Get get yourself fresh. Wake up and earn something, right. man. Get yourself familiar <laughs> with the brand and post the brand. Hey, look, it is what it is, man. So I said I wasn't gonna. Um, I said I said to myself, I ain't say this on a podcast. I said to myself, I wasn't gonna let Vita come up with no more topics, but. <laughs> Hold on, why? My topic. No, I'm just, right. I'm, just look, I'm just, I'm just, I'm just messing with you. I'm just messing don't with you. Don't be that way. <laughs> don't be that way. But look, this, this is all you today, man. This is all. I'm just here. I'm just here. I'm just here for the commentary. <laughs> oh, you you came up shit. with this topic, this or is... all the topics? <laughs> no, this no she came up with this one. Okay. Oh, don't do that. Yeah. <laughs> we switch. We go back and forth. Okay. Don't don't it's a teamwork. People, don't tell people the secrets. Well, you ain't do all of them either. Are you right? I okay. did not. Okay. I gave you your props after the ones you did. Okay. Oh, okay. Not on camera though. <laughs> oh, no, I did do it on camera. You did. You, nah. you said I did good after. You did. You did. I give you that. I give you that. Anyway. All right. What's so, up? What are we talking about? So, do we want to get started? Do we want to go over our week? How was your week? Oh man. Oh, you know what? My week was freaking great. Let me tell you, let me tell you, let me, let me tell you about my weekend. I went to go see uh I went to Charlotte. I went to go see BJ the Chicago kid. That was actually pretty dope. Um had meet and greet tickets, so uh, you know, got a chance to intermingle with him or whatever. Um okay. but he's a cool dude, man. He all right. He all right. He did a he did an excellent show. The show wasn't sold out, but I mean for the venue, you know what I'm saying? If it would have been sold out, I probably wouldn't have had a good time because it was like a smaller venue. Mm-hmm. But um, but yeah, it was all right, though. It was all right. Um, the openers were actually pretty good, too. It was like a girl from Cali, and I, I guess the guy was from Charlotte um, that opened up, man. They were actually really good singers, man. And like, you know, Shorty was, you know, Shorty was blowing. I was like, <laughs> I, was, I was sitting back there like, okay, I see you. Okay. That's yeah, what's up. What's up? yeah. You gotta find out who it is so you can put us on. Oh yeah, I got yeah, I gotta look that up. Yeah. I look it up and, and let you know. We appreciate. It. Oh yeah, oh we yeah. What, what about what about your weekend? Your weekend was good. Um yes, my weekend was very good. I went out. Um, I went to a little birthday party. It was great. I had a great time. There was a really good band there. I think their name is Eclectic, but I gotta find out all the information. But they were great. They were awesome. So um, I got real cute. That was my favorite part. I don't get to dress up a lot, so oh. I was real cute yesterday. Don't right. no, so, keep talking. Uh-huh. You but yeah, so that was fun. So all of that, it's been a good weekend. All right, Keith. My week was all right. My week was all right. Um, I didn't do too much. Spent time with the kids. Okay, okay, okay. You know, doing oh, the, yeah, I see. The, I the see. daddy uncle life. Yeah, I see. You. I see. Yo, her little outfit was tough, though. That, right. Yo, her little outfit was tough. I was like, yo, I fuck with that. We like, had yeah. a cookout back at the house. Oh, word. We did that the day before. Oh, yeah. Stayed up until like five o'clock. Got it done, though. Y'all was drinking, drinking? 
Sha 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 sha. Okay, all right, cool, cool. Hey man, ain't nothing wrong with that. Ain't nothing wrong with that. Mm-mm-mm. All right, you ready? Ready to get to it? I am ready. Ready Kiwan, are you ready? I'm definitely ready. Y'all ready? <laughs> I'm definitely ready. Am I ready? We have some practicing. Am I ready? Because I got a lot going on here today. So am I ready? Hey, look, we, right. we're chilling, man. <laughs> All right, so this week we are going to discuss social media in relationships. Because number one, I think I think it's important. I think it's important to talk about in relationships, and then um. We'll hit on how I feel as far as like what parts of it I think are important. But um, let's get started. Y'all ready? Yeah. Let's get it. You ready? ready? I'm ready. I'm ready. All right. So first of all, let's talk about this. How do y'all feel that social media is affecting relationships now? Because social media has become such a huge deal. Like how is that affecting how how people date? I'm going to go last. (laughs) (laughs) I'm going to go last. So... I feel like it can affect it positively or negatively. If you have an immature mind state and you are just on social media, like it's your life, it's going to affect it negatively because like who really wants to be on social media? Where I'm going? Lots of train of thought. (laughs) But um, but, but, um, from my perspective, uh, it's going to affect it on how I do things on you social media. I use it as a business platform instead of using it as, I guess, to be social. I use real life reality to be social. Okay. Um, yes, you can, you you should incorporate being social in social media, but is I don't use it as like, oh, I'm just going to meet friends or no. It's I'm doing everything that I post or everything that I do is for a purpose. Um, if you're immature and you're using it just to, I guess, have a social life, Mm-hmm. Then and be insecure. Then most people are gonna be insecure about it. So you gotta be mature. Grow with the times. Don't just be stuck in 2006 with social media and <laughs> when Twitter okay. was popping. Yeah. Twitter after dark. Exactly. Yeah, 06. Did we have Twitter in there? No. No, I think we didn't have was, Twitter in 06. I think we that was more. No, I we had MySpace, MySpace, Facebook. I think that was MySpace. When did Facebook? I knew. We were we were friends when Twitter was popping. I think it came out like oh seven. Because when you were staying in um you were staying in them New Games? Yeah. Or no, Eagle Landing. No, when you had the apartment. Oh, down fifty five. Yeah. yeah. And me and Dan used to come by Fendi. Twitter after dark, nigga. <laughs> we definitely was doing Twitter after dark. <laughs> That was like 07, 08. Yeah, it, it, it won't too far from 06. It won't too far from 06, 06 like two was, years later. 06 was the MySpace time where you had to put them in your top eight. Yeah. Yeah. I do remember that, though. But I mean, MySpace was popping. My space was... All right, so you answered your own question. I told you I was going last. <laughs> <laughs> don't, don't, don't try to interject and make me go second. <laughs> no. Um, I do feel... I, I, I agree. If you're immature, yeah, it could affect it negatively. If you are using social media to, like using it for clout to boost yourself, then yes, it is going to affect you negatively because because everything you're pushing is, is for everybody else. It's not for you. It's not for your relationship. Now, if you are mature, um, I think it can, I mean, at that point, it's kind of, I'm posting you or I'm posting something about you or I'm posting us because I want to. Like, it's not like I want everybody to like it. I, I this is just like for my own, my own, yeah. This is like, hey, I'm out with with such and such. Just because, you know, I just I just wanted to share that. It's not necessarily, I don't care if you like it. This is just, this is what I'm doing. This is what's going on with me today. And I mean, that's how, that's what I post on, on social media. It's like, if I'm out and about and I'm doing something or, you know, like if I'm real cute that day, um, <laughs> then that's when I'm going, <laughs> that's Fair when enough. I'm going to post. But other than that, like, it doesn't, it doesn't matter if you, if you like it or not, that's cool. So, but it, I mean, it does, it does take a certain level of maturity to be able to handle it. Relationships and social media. Yes, to be able to um, be in your relationship and social it media. It does take it does take a grand level of maturity because if you are not like let me get in my motherfucking oh, bag. Okay. Look, if you are not mature dealing with dating and social media, I mean it's just it's just gonna go downhill every time. So um dealing with this firsthand. Oh, you got stories. Oh, I got stories. Oh, oh I got stories. I got stories. So most people know me from 
one of many things, it, but it's all but it's all centered around something involving music or now this podcast. Mm -hmm. So, you know, when I have a Instagram, I don't have a personal Instagram. I don't have an Instagram that's personalized to me and my social doings. I have an Instagram that's personalized to me and music. It's always that me and music connection. Like if I post on uh, social media, it's either me with somebody that's dealing with music, whether you battle rap and I saw you out at an event or, you know, I went to a concert and snuck backstage and got a picture with you. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like that's, that's what I post. I feel like when the relationship is involved and you only have that sole Instagram, that's like, okay, well I'm doing music or I'm making beats or, or, you know, I'm producing music, whatever you're doing out of one of those three. Um, and they feel like, Oh, well you don't post me. Bitch, I don't post anybody. Like, I don't know what you, I don't know what you want to, what you want me to do. Like, you know, oh, when, when my friend posted such and such, I'm not your fucking friend. Like, definitely. you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm me all day. So, you know, it, it definitely takes that level of maturity and understanding. Like, if, if I'm with a young lady and she doesn't post me, but all she has is her, uh, is, matter of fact, I don't, I don't even care what she has. She can have her own personal Instagram. It doesn't matter to me. I don't care. You don't have to post me because I know where I'm at. You know, when you mm -hmm. where you at, you know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? Okay. If I hit you with what you doing and you slide through, I mean, I, I know what it is in real life. Like, I'm not trying to fabricate nothing for, for social media. I feel you. You know what I'm saying? Like, and, and, and it's like, if it doesn't happen on Instagram or Snapchat, it never happened. I'm like, nah, mm -hmm. nah, yo. Let's not I, let's not forget Facebook though. Yeah, well, Facebook too, man. But you know, <laughs> Cass is Cass is really is really gearing away from Facebook because you know aunties and uncles is on and grandmas is right, on Facebook. Right. Every time I post a picture, my grandma hit me with the hey hands. So grandma, <laughs> grandma, this is for my send this in a message, grandma. Don't put this on. <laughs> grandma trying to make sure you got one like, one like, <laughs> one, like, one comment. Thank you, grandma. <laughs> she be the first somebody one showing the love. Look, she be the first one to put some hey hands. So yes, and look, you know somebody. She I was talking to a young lady one time and she was like, who the hell is Sarah Noel? I, I said, that's my grandma. <laughs> Hold on, she came for grandma? She came for grandma. <laughs> no, don't come But she grandma. ain't know, she ain't know, she ain't know, I she ain't know. Yeah, I, 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 didn't, I didn't share that information with her, so she didn't know. She was like, who the fuck? <laughs> See, and this is where social media can negatively affect your relationship. Because exactly. we out here coming for grandma. Right. Calm down, y'all. Calm down. Grandma had a whole... She, she don't got no profile pictures. This is just a flower. You know, that's how I know it's grandma. <laughs> <laughs> She want to do is comment under my pictures and play Candy Crush. That's all she want to do. That's all, that's all she want. That's all she want to do. The immature ones. They exactly. Immature. But no, but no, immature. yeah. But yeah, you you definitely have to be mature to be able to conduct yourself in a relationship on social media responsibly. 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 Yes, responsibly. So we always at that point where we know we just didn't care what anybody had to say and probably just did some wild shit just because. This is true. This is true. This is how I'm feeling. So this is what I'm posting right now. I don't care who feel any type of way about it. And Yo. Facebook will bring those days back to you in those memories. I'll be like, oh my gosh. Remember one year ago you said fuck light skin girl? I'm like, God damn, dog. Shit. Facebook will haunt you. Like, yeah. Remember one day ago you said, man, I ain't fuck with this shit. Don't trigger me. Right. And then I'm like, who was I on that day? Who, right. hurt, who hurt me that who are day? You real? <laughs> You gotta look in the mirror. Who are you? <laughs> but yeah, so it seems like, okay, so it seems like there's both that having that maturity level and now that social media has involved to more networking. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. if you're using social media for networking, I can understand why you would be posting all your social life because that's not what it's about. You're out here trying to network. So right. I get both. I think that was that. the purpose from the jump for it to be networking. People just separated reality to what is on what I, cyber life I, I think i think i think it's i think it's more so like this bro i think it's because the celebrities are able to do both 
You know, you got your you got your Cardi B set. Oh, I'm gonna post my music or you know what I'm doing, and I'm also post uh, uh, Offset and and Culture. Gotcha, you know, gotcha. you know I can you know in, in their minds they can do both, and then you know you get you know whoever you dealing with like shit, Cardi B can do both. Why the fuck can't you do both? Like hmm. yo, like because nine times out of ten, as a male doing music. As a male doing music, your biggest supporters are going to be the females. Right. And they're not going to want to see a woman on your page. Right. That's why true. we want to be on your page, because we want them to know that they don't need to be in your DMs. But like he said, as an artist, business standpoint, women are going to be your most supporters, your you, best supporters. You like, know how, how, how many women that I've come across that have put me onto music? Like, they put me on different artists that I, I would have never heard otherwise. Like, um... Like, for instance, Sir, I would have never heard of Sir until I was dealing with a dealing with a chick that listened to Sir all the time. I was like, damn, this shit kind of rock, though. Like, like who this? Like, oh, this is Sir. I, I would have looking at the, the artwork that he puts out, looking at the song titles he put out. I would have never clicked on this shit. You know what I'm saying? But she put me on to that. So, you know, just having that understanding, I'm like, OK, well, yeah, you definitely have to have women pubbing your pubbing your stuff for you to be like, all right, cool. Matter of fact, the, the the way I sold my first beat was through a woman. Mm-hmm. I sold my first beat to an artist from through a woman through his girl. Okay. She was like, oh, this nigga make beats, and they all right. He was like, yo, my shorty said you make beats. I need one. <laughs> all right, cool. Sit nigga beat. He sent me back the track two days later. Mm-hmm. Again, that's about maturity because right. then it's, it is about like, okay, I see how you're using your social media, so I see why I'm not on there. Mm-hmm. But like you said, if the girl. It, I, even though you said it wouldn't matter, if somebody is using their social media socially right. and still refrains from, um, you know, ever posting anything about you, not saying, you know, right off gate, but if y'all are, you know, dealing with each other and nobody ever says anything, you're like, um, mm. <laughs> so who should do it first though? Oh, who should do it first, though? I don't think. I don't think, <laughs> I don't think that. I don't think it matters. I think okay. whoever wants to. I mean, I don't think it has to be like, oh, since you put me on, now, now I know I can put you on. Mm-hmm. No, if I want to, it's my social media. Right. If I put you on mine, I put you oh, on mine. That doesn't mean you have to And I, and I think I put, think that's where I think that's where translation gets lost at because right. they feel like. They feel mm-hmm. like it's follow Friday. They feel like, oh, you know, if you follow me, I follow you. Nah, like if I post you, you, you post, post me. Yeah. yeah, is it like that though? <laughs> is it as a woman, if you post your guy, do you expect him to post you? No. No. Okay. I I mean, I can I can see where that could be an issue for some people because like if you my MCM like by WCW, I'm be like <laughs> what you getting ready to do? I can see how that how that could cause But MCM don't necessarily mean that's your significant other though. No, it doesn't. But it if doesn't, it is, but if, it, but if you're talking to somebody, it better be. Because <laughs> I see a Drees <laughs> album get posted every Monday. <laughs> it uh, uh, what's, be. The, what's the other guy? Terrence J get posted every Monday. Mm-hmm. You know, I'm a, I'm gonna post Lorenz Tate all the time. He's MCE every day. Every day. The, the 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 short nigga. Somebody uh, said I look like him, but we gonna pass that. Okay. <laughs> the banter from the kitchen. <laughs> Somebody definitely said I look like him. I got a few, but yeah. Oh man. Right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, go ahead. For real. But you don't you don't have go. to go. I don't think it has to be back and forth. Because, like you said, if somebody is using their social media differently, Mm -hmm. then no. I mean, that's how you need to expect their social media to be used. Mm -hmm. But if if they are using it socially and they've either, you know, posted previous people or they're still posting Mm -hmm. like with other people, it's like, okay, so what makes me different? Like, why are you posting them and not posting me? And that might just be a conversation like that might not even be something that's the issue that might be something you talk about and you're like hey you know i used to post such and such and then something happened right. i had to go through and i had to delete all that stuff and i just don't want to do that again mm-hmm. like that just mm-hmm. might be a conversation but that's a conversation y'all need to have right right right, right. always yes right. Always. okay yes it's all about communication 
It is. And, not, and understanding. No, 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 no. Wait, wait, wait. Effective communication. You can talk all day, but that shit ain't effective in the motherfucker. For real. Effective communication. Go ahead. What were you going to say, sir? Oh, that, that's it. Okay, all right. <laughs> Yeah, effective communication because we can communicate all day. You can talk to you blue in the face, and I cannot understand a goddamn word you're saying. Mm-hmm. That's true. All right, I follow. <laughs> I'm all about communication. I'm all about communication. Communication is key. Communication is key to everything. So, um, so in that, in that, like we're saying, um, people just searching for likes. People mm-hmm. wanting them to like their relationship. Like, look at my new boo. Ain't he cute? Everybody mm-hmm, need to mm-hmm, like it. Or mm-hmm. ain't we cute? Everybody needs to like it. So, and people are just using social media in that way, just for you, just that thirst for likes. You being right, thirsty out right, here right. to see how how many likes you can get. Mm. Like then that's that's not how you want to mm-hmm. in a relationship. Right, if he don't get if he don't get a hundred likes on my page, I'm gonna break up with that right. nigga. And be like, oh, they must not think he he that cute. They do maybe, that. Maybe I need to. Really- <laughs> they do that, bro. Yeah. They do that. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, they want to see. <laughs> they want to see. They want to see. Like, do my girls think he cute? Like, how many people liking him? Really, bro? I'm, bro. It's a sickness, bro. It is. You, this, if, is, this is bad. If you ain't know, now you know. That thirst for life is real. Man, that look, thirst for life that's what y'all meant by thirst for you life. You know what, bro? I, I, <laughs> bro, back when I back when I was at five, back when I was at five k on Instagram. No, here we I go. Had a, no, no, no. Not back when I was at five. Yeah. Back, back when I was five. <laughs> Yeah, right, 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 right. Back when I had 5K, uh, I was uh, talking to this one young lady and um, she had got my Instagram and gave me her number at the same time. I said, okay, cool. You know, text her, text her, text her. Day three, I had text her. I was like, yo, you straight? Like, you know, gave me a number. Like, you ain't responded. And she hit me. She was like, oh, you ain't got enough followers on on Instagram. I said, hey, yo. (laughs) For real. I said, hey, yo. Who the, who the? I and what make it so bad? She was our age, right? How many followers she had? But yeah, Kiwan, she had like uh, I want to say she had like she had like twenty five k, man. Jeez. Yeah, she what she, did she, she, she right. What did she do? She a bottle girl. She a bottle girl in oh, Greensboro. Oh, that makes sense. Yeah. You think she a model for real? Yeah, she. Th- oh, okay. <laughs> I see. <laughs> okay. Yes. Think, shots fired. Think she a model for real? Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. So and the club she worked at closing down. <laughs> <laughs> I just heard that yesterday too. Ooh, so much oh, happening man. right now. So much shade. Yeah, man, it's a lot of shade, man. It's a oh, lot of shade. So how many? Did she tell you how many followers were okay? Like you was only at five k. Yes. No. 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 Like. No. Nah, like I, I, I didn't even want to know. Like I was just like, oh, I'm straight. Like if you worried about social media and followers. Yeah, I'm straight. Y'all, please get in there and real tell life. us how many followers we need to have. <laughs> because obviously, I'm way slacking because I ain't even hit 5K. So I just need to know how I'm, to, how I'm to conduct my with, life. With my nine, with my <laughs> nine five, like I'm good with that. I'm straight. I'm not a bottom girl, so. But is it how many people followers you have, or how many? People actually interacting with the post that you have. See, that's the thing. Because though, you man. can have 500 followers. And get 500 likes or right. 500 views. But you know what, bro? That's better than having yeah. 25 and Quality having 500. Quality over quantity. Yeah, but you know what, bro? She won't even get that many. I, I think, I, you know, personally, I think she bought a lot of her followers because mm-hmm. she, the likes that she was getting for her pictures versus the following amount that she had compared to other people who got it organically, I was just like, yeah, you bought them followers. Like, I, I know your he game. He he I know he your game. Only at 5K, she was at 25K. Hey, man, look. He's salty Haters. Haters. Hey, man, Haters. look. I mean, I can only com- I can only compare and contrast. That's all I can do because I'm not living that lifestyle. Haters. I, I am nobody's bottle girl. Hey. Okay. I, I'm definitely not nobody's bottle girl, so all I can do is compare and contrast. Okay. Mm-hmm. Thank you. Mm-hmm. You're welcome. I, just, I had to make sure you knew. <laughs> I, I appreciate that. I appreciate that. Sometimes you have to let me know. All right. So, also, let's talk about using social media to date. Like we said, sliding in the DMs. Mm. Is, is that okay? Is that okay to just slide in random people's DMs? Does it work? Go ahead, go, go ahead and um and attack this first, and I'm I'm, I'm gonna come in, I'm gonna come in right behind you with the swift, oh, with the swift hook. You are gonna come in second this time. You are gonna come in second hook. this time. Okay. So personally, I I tried it before. Um, 
but it's not my thing. I'm the type of person to meet somebody in person or meet somebody through a friend, a close friend that actually knows me and knows that's the type of person, that's the type of female that I would like. Sliding in DMs is like, it could be anybody. You could be cat- catfishing somebody and, or they could be catfishing you. And, you know, these filters make women look like models for real, like 10, 10 models. Man, look, let me, <laughs> because we went to college with a couple chicks, bro. For real. Outside of them filters, because you be looking at them on social media like, damn, she bad as hell. You see at the union, be like, yo, what the fuck? That's, bro, not, that's her. not her, bro. That's not her. That's on God, that's not her. Yo, when them <laughs> filters came out, man. Yeah. Make your skin look smooth. What? Right. No. This was before makeup was popping, too. Right, Like, right. makeup just really started getting popping, popping, like, last, like, four or five years. Yeah, I give it that. I give it that. So, yeah. Because they got tutorials now, so you don't fuck it up. You know what I'm saying? Like, if you if you do it right, you do it, if you do it they with her, they, they, they do. Mess it up. They do. Because them contrasts be all, yep. you know what I'm saying? Contours, be light-skinned up here, blending. dark-skinned down here. Like, <laughs> don't be blending. You be trying to use a different shade. You're you getting use the wrong color. foundation. It's okay. Use your color. Use your color. You still going to be cute like, if you nah, use I'm your color. I'm trying to be light-skinned today, bitch. <laughs> no, because your neck is rusty. For real. <laughs> your neck rusty. Your neck rusty. Don't... Use the right color, please. Oh, Use the right color. So do sliding DMs work for you, though? I haven't slid into anybody's DMs. Never. Has have, anybody, right. Has anybody slid in your DMs? People might have. I be leaving people on red. <laughs> See? <laughs> you a light-skinned chick and a dark-skinned woman body. For real. <laughs> and that's why I don't slide in DMs, because... My my ego not gonna get hurt just because you seen my shit. I know I'm cute. <laughs> I know I'm cute. Yes. So self-aware. Yeah. Yeah. I'm aware. Yeah. 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 I know I'm cute. So I don't got enough followers or something. <laughs> <laughs> Your follower count too low. It's too low. Your follower count too low. Oh man. I don't get enough likes. Follower count too low. Yeah, man. I, I don't. I, I don't slide in DMs, man. You don't slide in DMs. Nah, nah man. Nah, you be out here telling people. Sliding your DMs, and you're not gonna. Oh, they can slide in mine. I say what's up. I say what's up. You're not gonna leave them on scene. Mm-mm, you nah. check. The, I, I speak mm-mm. to everybody. You I check the follower count. No, mm. I don't talk about your follow count. Look, the less the better. And if you and if you cute, cute in real life, and you got a low follow count, oh, I'm on it. Right, I'm on it. We about to glow each other. Up. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Let, 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 look, let let a chick with under a thousand followers and be cute as hell. Oh, shit, what up with it? That's my boy. Everybody, please slide to this man's DMs, please. I can't deal with this. Slide to his DMs, nah. But would it would it work for real if a girl slid in your DMs? Like, is that a you know is what? that a nice start to a relationship? Is you, that okay? You mm-hmm. know what? If she has confidence when she speaks, if she knows what she's talking about, if she finds something that that pulls that's that's already listed as my interest and pulls me in yo i'm on it like she she'd be like you know what i'm saying uh nigga i heard you uh you say i see that you make beats or whatever you know what i'm saying i play a little violin here and there or i do the guitar a little bit oh, you know she's what i'm saying shot for real. yeah yeah she's shooting her shot for real like <laughs> she playing oh, violin oh, oh, oh. <laughs> well no not not even but not even playing the instrument if she yeah. if she be like oh you know i see that you fuck with uh i see that you fuck with a uh uh, uh uh, R&B music, you know what I'm saying? Like, yo, you all be playing R&B music on your live? Like, yeah, you know what I'm saying? I fuck with, uh, you know, fuck with a little Tevin Campbell here and there, da 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 whoop doo oh, you know? Okay. Can, yeah, we right. Right. Can, we- Can we talk for a minute? Yeah. I not. just want to know your name. <laughs> <laughs> Nigga, I be mean, like, I be saying they know the shit, but no, nobody want to... Don't nobody want to serenade with me and shit. Sure don't. Sure don't, but I got you. I be, I, I, uh-huh. be, try, I be trying to croon on the podcast. Niggas don't be, <laughs> be trying. That's all I got for you. That's all you get. That's all you get. Um, <laughs> so y'all would be cool with, with a female sliding in your DMs? Like, I think most cool guys would be cool with a female sliding in your DMs. Just off the fact, most women aren't really shooting their shots. So the one that got enough confidence to actually shoot her shot, Facts. or not even confidence, but not going against what the stigma is, is women don't shoot they shot for real. Oh, you different, different. Okay. <laughs> you know I like what? that. You know what? It's this little dating site called Bumble, and women have to shoot. <laughs> women, you nigga know about this shit. Women gotta shoot the first shot, though. But you know what? 
when I was on Bumble, I liked it because women had to be creative. Definitely. Because if you Definitely. hit me with the, hey, how you doing? You know, I'm going to be like, bro, you ain't read nothing on my page. I done took time out and crafted some shit. You know what I'm saying? You could have said anything. You could have, you, you, you could have, you, you complicated for real. <laughs> this dude said, you ain't read nothing on my page. Right. As a guy, I just say hello. Hi, how you doing? Bro, no. Thank you. Thank you. Does it take too much to start looking at your page and be like, huh? He likes this. Okay, let me <laughs> no, let me Google but, it but, but you and see what I can say. But but you could have read like the I think I think my bio said I think my bio said something like it was something simple, but uh you know it, it might have been like yo, you know what I'm saying? My name Ab, you know what I'm saying? Like 31. I like uh I like Marvel movies, uh Skittles, uh 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 crisp M&Ms. And I know the difference between it, there, there, and there. I think I think that's what that, that might have been what it was. I'm, I'm, like, I'm sure it didn't say all of that, but I promise you it did. Okay, so you want them to come and be like, "Hey, have you seen the latest Marvel movie?" It's definitely. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> if you have it, nigga, let's that's go. That's a that's a okay, what you doing for real? Plans. And coming with plans, I like it. Right, come I like it. Way. Okay, so if you if you're looking at their social media, and you sliding into DMs. You need to you need to actually. Yeah. Look at what they like. For him, though. Oh, For oh. most guys, they just want... If you show them some attention, they definitely respond. Well, okay. I'm not I'm not in that section of guys. Right. Like, I'm I'm in I'm, I'm in the subclass. That's because he, like, he got 10K followers. <laughs> he ain't worried about one person. <laughs> well, bougie, in the now. Yeah, yeah, now he uppity. <laughs> Nigga, you lived with me. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Now you got, now you got and I've seen the work. <laughs> <laughs> and I've seen the work. <laughs> Now you gotta look at his beats and stuff. Like. <laughs> no, not even, man. But you know, just, just, just you know, all you gotta do is make a little comment, like you know, to nigga that that vest you had on was kind of tough. Like I fuck with that shit, you know. Make comment about my fashion. I'll be dressing, yo. Say I don't. You and you are. Um, <laughs> you know what? You are here, yo. You a whole hater, man. Look, you already like I said, you got. TNK people boosting you, so I'm gonna have to bring you back down. I have to deflate you every Sunday. All right. So, <laughs> terrible. What man. about when people just like pics until you notice? Like, what if somebody mm. come through and like all your pics? Like, are you gonna be like, hey, I noticed you liked all my pictures? I am not sending that message. <laughs> I swear to God. I'm definitely I'm saying what's up, though. <laughs> You like on my pitch. Hi, how you doing? What's your Thank you. Maybe what's your name? Depending if your 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 tag is not really your name. Okay, okay. Just, Might do some research a little bit. See who she is. Uh-huh. But you know what? I, I, I want to be organic. I want to just okay. Just jump in there, like okay. How you doing? Okay. Like what's up? Right, because because she liked all your pictures. Exactly. You, you least, seen something you that you like? Think, you see something that you like? <laughs> something was up there. For real. You like something? Likes. You know, okay. you gonna thank her for for the likes. I mean, to be honest with you, I really don't be. I, I've really never had a situation where a girl came through and liked all of my pictures. I've never had that happen. I mean, not all of them, but she like liked 10? a significant amount in a row. So when you what's open a significant up, amount? Though? When you open well, yeah, what's, it up, what's, what's a when you open it up, you see nothing but her. Like, like she like okay. this. She like this. She like. This, I've she never, like this. I've never had that happen. Okay, I so think, people, I need y'all. I think, I think that's this. a big cat, people. This is ad with ten thousand followers. <laughs> right, that's a big cap. <laughs> no, it's, it's no cap, dog. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna be honest with you, bro. Not you one time me like that. <laughs> not, not five, at least. Okay, yeah, at least like five. Yeah, like that's what like, she's talking about. Okay, like, okay. So when you open up, you, you know, know, I got, the, I got the max. I you... got the max, so it showed like fifteen at a time. <laughs> <laughs> well, if she has a significant amount, then why are you so complicated? <laughs> <Definitely>. <laughs> Why you gotta be difficult? I'm if sorry. Like I'm more, sorry. If she like more than three pictures, okay. If she she's like trying to get your attention, okay. If she like more than three pictures, yeah. okay. I, I can see how she was trying to get my attention. Okay. Thank okay. you. Are you going to speak to her? Yes, I will. I will speak to the Thank next you. girl that comes to my Instagram and likes three pictures. Okay. More than three pictures. Like more than three. Like yeah. three. Like 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 at least like six. Do an even number. Like six. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. Three. Damn, man. Can't win for losing. What? Oh, don't give her a number. Just go like some pictures and we'll make like, like some pictures. We'll make sure like some he pictures gets and, back to you. Like some pictures and slide in and say hi in my DM. Hold on. No, she already liked your pictures. This is saying I oh. want you to come in my DM. Oh, okay. Okay. Well, yeah. Come like some pictures then. King Bot. K V N G B A K. Instagram, Twitter. <laughs> I can't. 
watching it with you. Okay. <laughs> okay. So, all right. So now let's talk about, okay, if you are using your social media socially, okay, or maybe even if you aren't, if you're in like a real deal for real relationship, mm-hmm. like real for real, y'all been in this for some for for a minute. Mm-hmm. Like this ain't this ain't nothing new. Like y'all are in a relationship. When does it become okay to post them? Mm-hmm. So, I'll tackle this. Um, so when it comes to my perspective of posting on your social media, I feel like it's a reward first and foremost. Because this is the expectation of women. They want you to post them on their social media. So if you haven't shown me anything, if you haven't proven to me that this is going to be long term, why am I posting? From both perspectives, though, from both perspectives, if you I'm not just going to post somebody and you my girl this week, but next week we broken up. That's not that's not how this work out. Now you're just looking like a hoe on social media. So I feel like there's had to be some standards set. And there has to be some patience to be had when posting people on your social media. I'm with it. I'm with it. Yeah, it definitely needs to be like, I need to know that you're going to stay. I need to know that I'm not going to have to delete this picture next week. I need to know that I'm not going to have to come back to my not 5K followers and tell them, <laughs> and tell them that, you know, this didn't work out. Because now they're looking at me like, she can't keep a man. She done had three men on that. <laughs> yo, and I be judging too, yo. When I, when I, when I, when I, yo, when I hop on social media, I be like, damn, she got a new boo already? <laughs> damn, what happened <laughs> to the last nigga? And I be knowing, like, sometimes I be knowing the cat. I be like, damn, she was just fucking with that nigga Trey. Like, what happened? To- damn. You know, I be, he'd be like, damn, I don't want to hit Trey ask what happened, but shit. <laughs> right, now we're involved. We're invested. Now I need right. to know, I need to know why y'all broke up. Like, I need a post, I need an additional post before you take down the pictures. Because mm-hmm. I don't, I hate having to go back and having to scroll through and be like, oh, she did delete the other day. When did she do that? Mm. And don't like, feel no pressure. Don't feel no pressure from the significant other about posting. Yeah, bro. Let me let me let me speak to that uh-huh. man because I've 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 had I've had a situation to where I felt pressured to pose my significant other, and you know it wasn't the fact that I didn't I didn't post my significant other. I just didn't post my significant other on the platform where I had the most followers. Oh. You know, <laughs> oh, that the followers <laughs> still count. Right, right. Like the the followers still count in this point. So, all right. So, boom. At this time, I might have had like 11k on Instagram. At the at the, no, no let, 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 let me. Yeah, I was at 11k at one time. Like I, you know, so I was at 11k on Instagram, and um, young lady I was dealing with, um, I would post her on like my Snapchat and Facebook. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like you know, niggas. Niggas I fuck with hardcore is my niggas on Facebook, regardless. Like, you my friend on Facebook, Mm -hmm. cameraman my friend on Facebook, Vita my friend on Facebook. Y'all niggas ain't never went nowhere. Y'all niggas always been on Facebook. You know what I'm saying? So, I mean, if I post you on Facebook, and I got my family on Facebook. So, I mean, that's that's really where it means the most to me. If I post you on Facebook, like, why is it a problem I don't post you on Instagram when Instagram is my moneymaker? That's where I get, you know, I'm I'm selling my beats at. Like, that's where I'm doing, you know, all my music shit at. Um... And, you know, it was, it was, it was, it was like, oh, well, you know, you ain't post me on your Instagram and you try to hide me. Bitch, I put you on everywhere else. Everything is fucking connected. Facebook and Instagram are fucking connected. (laughs) If you got my Instagram, I pop up on, do you know this person? On your fucking Facebook. (laughs) Like, if you were looking for me, you can find me. If you were looking for me, you can find me. Real talk. Facebook. Facebook be telling everybody snitching. Not even, not even, not even just posting a random picture on Facebook and like, you know, letting it fall away in the feed. No. That shit gets put in the future pictures. Mm. That shit won't even enough. I'm just like, yo, come on, man. I can't win for fucking losing. Mm. Not when it comes to posting on social media. With significant others, you're not gonna win, bro. You can't all. win. You can't win. You can't. You can't. You win might as well just it. post or just break up, because it could be more than just. Oh, we've been together for how long, and you still ain't post me? What's going on though? Why you hiding me though? Right. It, it's like why you hiding me, but it's not. But it's not like you wasn't there from when I first bought my first beat machine. You wasn't there from when I started my Instagram page and made it into a business page mm-hmm. and st- and cleared everything off that was personal to me to start putting, you know, shit that I was actively doing in in the in the music industry. You oh, know what I'm saying? She went with you in the gym. 
No, she was no. I'm, I'm saying she's acting like she wasn't. Oh, she was. And that's, yeah, she and, was. That's, and that's where I get it. That's where I get like confused about because I could be showing you off in like real life, real life, bro. Like real life, like I'm everywhere taking you everywhere. Like everywhere we are in public, PDA, all type of stuff. And but I don't push you on social media, so that's a problem now. This is a gratification thing. Oh, you want everybody like not just. Not just real people that actually see us out and about, but people she that you really don't care, care, give a fuck about. She want Bantu over in India to know that, you, that y'all <laughs> together and shit. Right. Bantu ben, gotta be like, oh, Bantu, oh, oh. <laughs> she would keep one. <laughs> <laughs> definitely would. Definitely, oh, oh, she would keep Definitely. <laughs> Okay. Fuck man too, man. For real? I don't even know band too. <laughs> right. Honestly, nah, I'm good. I'm like, if you with me in public, that's what I'm mostly concerned about. I'm not with it. Like, I feel in the beginning of social media, in the beginning, if we go all the way back mm-hmm. to like the MySpace days before it was networking, when it was just like I'm showing off everything to my friends. Mm-hmm. Right, right, right. When it was like that, that's when like Oh, you ain't gonna put your relationship status on Facebook. Oh, if it ain't on man. Facebook, it ain't real. If it ain't on Facebook, it ain't real. Yo, that relationship status had a lot of niggas <laughs> fucked up, man. <laughs> that relate that shit had a lot of niggas <laughs> fucked up, man. Oh, when you but put you in know a what? relationship and you don't put with who? Oh, <laughs> you know what? Yo, yo I'm, I'm gonna tell you. I'm gonna tell you what. I'm gonna tell you what. Our roommate had the most ingenious plan ever. <laughs> he had the most ingenious plan ever. He had two Facebook pages and he put himself in a relationship with himself. Yo, that shit was fucking genius, yo. That wasn't like, me, though. I feel like I remember this. It's Do still I, happening. It's, it, it never stopped. It's Do still happening. Yes. Okay. No, definitely, damn. Definitely know the roommate. He did. No, that's why I'm like, I feel like I remember this. Hey, yes. yes. He was in a relationship with himself. Yes. Yes. Wow. Yes. Yes. He, 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 that was ingenious. That was clever. That, that was clever right now. now. Because he... That was a loophole. Hey, it, 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 it was, was a, loophole. a definite loophole. Or you could just take your relationship status off Facebook. Like, mm-hmm. mine doesn't say single or in a relationship. I don't let these people know what I'm doing. <laughs> you don't know if... I still shoot your shot, brother. <laughs> you don't know what's going on in my life. You don't know. So I'm just, just wait like, for somebody to shoot their shot. Just take it completely with plans. Off of Facebook. I ended up honestly though, honestly. So when Facebook started, so back in the day mm-hmm. with the MySpace days, all of that. So I was in a relationship, and we did put it up, and we were together for a very long time. Like we were together for like. It's a college five, dude? Yeah, we were together okay. for like five years. So when we when we split up to get rid of some of that, like everybody kind of being in your business, mm-hmm. instead of changing our relationships as a single, we removed our relationship status, both of us. Okay. So it, it still we, showed up. But it doesn't, it doesn't necessarily say such and such is now single. Niggas grab their balls, roll into your DM. <laughs> like, yeah, my ball rolls in here, man. <laughs> Yo, when I, I see that, when no, I see that fucking post. If you like that, I'm going to be like, yes, I'm on it. Like, <laughs> Yo, when I, I, I see that like post, this. that nigga was like, no, it was, no, it wasn't the ball. It I saw a, the, and I, a dog. Yeah, it was a dog. Definitely the dog. He was like, damn, damn, Cujo done ran in here. I'm sorry, man. My bad. That's the way he you run out sometimes. My bad. What's your name, though? <laughs> Yo, that shit had me weak. Like but you know what? That's fucking creative, though. That's yeah, fucking creative as hell. All right. So now we talked about posting your significant other on social media. What about just allowing your significant your significant other to follow you on social media? Like, are you following them? Are you? How do y'all feel about following each other? Uh, it's whatever. Okay. I'm personally I'm secure with myself. Oh. Hopefully my lady is secure with herself as well, and it doesn't clash with the likes that you get on your pictures from other from the opposite sex. Um. So, go ahead. Let's follow each other. Let's be in each other's business. Okay. If if we together together and we have like an understanding and we have communication. Then anything I post on social media is certain be a surprise to you. Right. So. That makes sense. Yep, and that's facts. Um, 
I'm I'm with it. I don't mind following when I have a significant other. I don't mind. I don't mind following them. Um, I want to see your fans. How many people actually like you? Okay. Yeah. Because I'm gonna definitely be on there like this. That's my boo. Go ahead, guys. Yeah. Go ahead. Do you that big. You better have five thousand followers. <laughs> right, right, right. Likes. I'm like gonna be a boo. fan too, right along with them. Oh, you liking pictures? Like, damn. I like it. Yeah. Yes, yeah. Like I'm the definitely pictures. like. like <laughs> you, 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 po- you post some shit. You post some shit with your little butt poker. Hey, shit, girl, you know what I do to you. <laughs> I don't, uh, I don't know about wait. the butt poker though. Cause <laughs> if we in a relationship, if we in a relationship, uh, certain no. pictures and stuff should be like okay. So what? So what? So what pictures shouldn't be posted like when you're in a relationship? Because you don't want to change that person. You don't want to be too derogatory. Okay, like, that's the word, right? Yeah. Like you don't want to be too like out there. Like you want to keep about, it. I'm talking about she got like a nice dress on. She she went out to a van. Like be the pictures. Like if you had a nice dress on, you went out to an event and your butt poking a little bit. Like see, oh, it, it was poking. It was poking. I see it. Just so you know. I see it. I see it. When she came out, I said, "Who the fuck?" <laughs> y'all. If y'all don't follow me, please follow me and go look at them pictures because I was cute. Thank you. Um. <laughs> so yeah, I'm, yes, I'm definitely cheers into that. <laughs> yes. But okay, so in that case, like you were saying, like liking pictures, liking and commenting, y'all comment. Oh, on I'm pictures? liking, commenting, mm-hmm. I'm doing that. Oh. I might do cartwheels on your shit. Oh. Right, yes, for real. I'm, I'm the number one cheerleader. We all of that. We want all of that. Like yo, like if 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 I got a, if I got a significant other, she posts some shit on social media that's cute. Now I'm you know I'm gonna like it. I'm gonna comment it. I'm going to send it to your DM with a, with, with a comment in it. Like, damn, girl, you shit. You know how I fuck shit. Who your man at? <laughs> <laughs> where, your, where your man at real quick? Tell, you know, you role play over social. Where, where your man at real quick? Definitely. You know what I'm saying? Fuck that nigga. Tell him I said. T- t- look, I said what's up. I said what's up. What's happening? <laughs> what you doing tonight? Can you have friends? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right. Can you have friends? Can all that. Friends? All that. Yes. Can you have friends? Yeah, Definitely. like that playful banter, though, like over social media, that's that cute. shit's fucking That's cool. cute. It's, I like that. That shit's fucking cool man it keeps it not like so serious not because you know social media can get complicated it can get difficult so if you have if you're a humorous in real life and you bring that to social media then i feel like you'll have more of a a, a better relationship with a, a better connection with the person that you're dating right Absolutely. that's that's I'm true that. that's true because I'm, I'm with, with all that. the antics i'm with, <laughs> I'm with, I'm with all the antics i'm always pushing in again so i'm always down for it um okay so um, I feel the same way, especially my my IG is public. So I would feel honestly like my it's public. Mm-hmm. So you might as well, because if not, I, I don't know about men. I can't speak for men. But as women, if your IG is public and we're not following you, we are still following you. We are looking at this every is true. post. We are this looking at every post. It's Big easier facts. for me to just click the button so you can show up in my timeline instead of every day having to go to the little search bar and you be like what you right. 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 Don't, don't even follow you be popping up on your on your story feed be like what the motherfucker I see you and, and then be on some funny shit in a conversation later on the phone talking about so what you was talking about on social media? What you mean what I was talking about? <laughs> right. You don't even follow me. Then, look, don't let you have a business page where you can see, oh, you've had 300 people come by your profile today. Oh, shit, who came by the profile? This motherfucker. <laughs> Here she go. Here she go. Here she go with the bullshit. <laughs> I just posted the fucking picture. Your ass the first one up there like this. <laughs> with the eyes right exactly no, and, I, and I I will say I am guilty of it <laughs> I'll be up there looking Even because I feel like if we haven't had that conversation about whether or not I can follow you because please believe as soon as we start talking I know all of your social media <laughs> I found you so they I should mean, hire all women for the FBI. All for women real. apply for the FBI. I found you. And then when they ask for qualifications, say Instagram. That's all you have to say is Instagram. I'm seeing you. So yes. You can find this I, nigga anywhere. But I am careful not to look at your story and I'm not gonna uh try to look at your videos. Oh, you incognito. Definitely, because she don't want to be actually seen. Yeah, I don't want you to know I can see you. She ain't liking no pics, though. Until you, <laughs> until, you <stop. laughs> until you do something I don't like. And then I'll be like, oh, I saw your little picture on social media. <laughs> Why not be a little picture there? Oh, I, <laughs> see, little I see your little picture I with that you. bitch. Yeah. <laughs> I see your little comments, too. Oh, you oh no, oh, no, 
you you can't see comments no more. Oh shit, the fall season, fuckboy fall is in full effect. You can't even see the activity bar is gone. Fuckboy fall is in full if effect. If you don't follow the person? Yeah, if you follow the person, you can't see what they've done. You can't see the pictures they like. You can't see the pictures they commented on. Instagram took that off. Fuckboy fall is in full effect. I'm talking about the comments on your pictures. But yes, they did take that away. Oh, fuck boys. <laughs> Time to level up. <laughs> Level up. <laughs> Level up. Level up. I don't know how I feel about what's going on over here. Perfect. You I don't like me. it. I don't like it. All right. So we let in. Okay. So letting your significant other follow you. We're good with that. What about their friends? So all of my bitches got friends. <laughs> <laughs> He got us all right. <laughs> yeah. All the time. This is what I deal with. Okay. Um. Go ahead, Kiwan. Go ahead. You, you're the guest. You go. You go ahead and, and strike first. Um, Cause I feel like I feel like we're gonna hit the same point. So necessarily, when you follow others' friends, they that don't necessarily mean that they're gonna follow on your timeline. Um. Now I feel like it gets kind of blurry when you're liking all the friends' pictures. You're commenting on. Now nah, that's a little too much. You going. You growing out of line. Is you crossing the board. So. Let's just, if we're going to follow the friends, let's just keep it as friends. Let's just keep it as, I don't really talk to you like that. So let's just, uh, you just, you, you following me and I'm following you. So we can keep updates on what I'm doing. You want to keep updates on what I'm doing for your girl. And I want to keep updates on if my girl out with you, what she doing. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> No, it's not the button that I wanted. That's the button that I wanted. That right there. That right there. All right. So, Kiwa, I do agree with you, sir. I do agree with you. Um, so, so dealing with dealing with a long term relationship, um, distance wise. Not, no, no, long, long, long term. term. Oh, long like term. y'all been together for yeah, a long time. Yeah, no, we was together okay. for a minute, my okay. nigga. So dealing with a long term relationship, especially me moving out of the city, mm-hmm. you know what I'm saying? Dealing with a long term relationship, um, dealing with. Matter of fact, I'm gonna put it this way: her friends were already low key my friends. Mm-hmm. We just didn't need to figure that shit out. You know what I'm saying? So like a lot of people, she knew, mm-hmm. I knew. You know what I'm saying? So. Following them, well, following each other, that shit was already happening. But, um, I mean, I was cool with it because, you know, them was my peoples. You mm-hmm. know what I'm saying? Like, before her, them was still my boys. You know what I'm right. saying? Whether it be frat or, you know, I knew them niggas through one of the frat, whatever. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Like, I, I know them niggas already. So, I mean, a lot of that was cool. And then, like, there's significant others. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, uh, one of the frats, whites might follow me or whatever. You know what I'm saying? So, and then, Right. Her and her are cool, you know. So I was cool with that. But um, but yeah, no, I I I I dig it how you can keep dibs on. You know what? Girls think they fucking sneaky, bro. <laughs> let, me, let, me, let me tell you about this. Girls think they fucking sneaky, man. So let me tell you about this shit, man. It's funny when they don't account for everything. Right. Because they don't know who you're following that. They're friends with, oh, yeah, I'm with so-and-so tonight. All right, cool, cool. Check so-and-so Instagram. They with their whole boo tonight. Oh, oh, shit. Oh, on the story, too. <laughs> oh, shit. What is really going on? So What's really? But I Ladies, get what, you, what you hiding? Right. I really get what's going on. But no, no, I peeped it, though. I peeped it, though. But I get what you're saying, though. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. You keep a tabs on me. Cool. I'm cool with that. Right. You know what I'm saying? And then I'm keeping tabs on you because if that's your man girl, that's your home girl, that's who you fuck with. I'm like, all right, yeah. And you know they're going to post on social media. Got to. They got to. They, <laughs> they got can't to. help it. They got to. You ain't give her the Definitely pep can't talk. Help it. Look, you ain't <laughs> give her the pep talk. Look, that's one thing guys is good about doing. Like, if, 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 I don't even think good at. I think it's like a guy cold. Like, right. If we out doing something, then you know. No, not, not even. Not even. Okay, Kiwan. Because to be honest, when we lived together, you were probably around the house more than me and Dev were. Definitely. 
So if me and Dad were out doing some shit, we'd be like, yo, Keith, we about to go out and do such and such. We didn't even have to tell you shit. He was like, shit, I ain't posting on social media today. <laughs> not like you did it, not like you did it all the time anyway, right, but right. you know what I'm saying? Like niggas knew us three. Mm -hmm. Like, you know, like shit, Together I'm gonna check Dev Instagram. I'm gonna check Keith on Instagram. Oh, that nigga ain't doing nothing tonight. <laughs> whole time I'm in college being a whole fucking fuck boy. <laughs> Definitely. <laughs> I'm being a whole fucking fuck boy, you know? Be like, well shit, he ain't doing nothing tonight. I don't know where he at. Don't even hit my DM talking about what happened. I don't he know. Don't know. From what I know, he was in his bad sleep. He wanna don't know. The lies. I don't. Just, no, I but he didn't lie. know. He did. He didn't know. If I say I was going out somewhere, he don't know what time I'm gonna be back. Mm -hmm. So often he know I left for five minutes and came back. Mm -hmm. like, we ain't keep tabs on each other. Yo. I when mean, we stayed, I mean, when, when we stayed in that one apartment, that shit was so fucking big, I didn't even see Kiwan. Oh, Kiwan was on the other friend. side of the house. <laughs> that shit was big as fuck. That nigga was on the other side of the house. Like, I, I saw, didn't know if they was coming or going. I saw, you know what? I saw Kiwan two times. I saw Kiwan when he went to class and when he came home from class. That's the only two times I seen Kiwan. Other than that, I ain't seen him. Or when he had that little bag sneaking out. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Uh-oh, secrets, secrets. <laughs> oh, you know, secrets. shit, I just happened to be in the kitchen talking to Dev. Kiwa was like, all right. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Well, we, we didn't ask no questions because, yo, look, bro, if something happened, you make sure you call us. Mm -hmm. End of the day. I mean, I feel like I feel like we're like that, too. Like, I'm not, if I know you out where you're not supposed to be, I'm not posting you. Like, as like as your, as your homegirl, as your friend? No, I'm not supposed to have. If we out and she ain't supposed to be here, I'm here by myself. Mm, you you aiding in the bed. <laughs> here by myself. That's a crime. I she, go out by myself all the time. Nobody she gonna post on her story. And then when she get to her friend, click. I'm out here. I'm out here. Get a, get a whole arm and shit. And nigga like me be like, that's that bitch arm. Go back. Go back. Go back. <laughs> Just chilling, getting a drink, like, yeah, nigga, we lit, we lit. Right. It it's just happened to be by yeah, nigga, we lit <laughs> by a stranger. Right. right. And she ordered a drink herself. She ain't paid me no fucking mind. Nope. And don't let don't let it geotag you. Oh, damn. <laughs> Cause next time you be I like, we that, lit, we lit. I'll I'm turn be that like, shit all the way to fuck. <laughs> like, Who lit? lit? We lit. <laughs> we, we pulling up. <laughs> we lit. <laughs> we all in the bar now. <laughs> We didn't pull it up. <laughs> Nigga, who did you say was lit? <laughs> yes, we <laughs> all lit. How the fuck did you get here? <laughs> we all lit. It's one o'clock. The club up was on. And I'm in here. You were, you were your whole night girl. Yeah. Right? Yes. You got to hear yes. faster than me. <laughs> <laughs> Burn on and all. They let you yes. in with them shoes? Yes. Because I told him, I seen my nigga on Facebook Live, and he was in here. Yo, bouncers don't be giving a fuck, yo. They really when, don't. When Raleigh Live used to be open, I was in line. I was in line with one of my homeboys. We were going to the club. I was in line, and Shorty said that her dude was in there. The nigga just let her in. I'm like, yo, bro, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> like, like the nigga was holding the line. It was cold as fuck outside. Shorty was like, my man in there. I need to get him. He was like, yeah, all right, Shorty. He done unbuckled he the fucking shit. Problem. Right, definitely wasn't a problem. problem. She was like four foot two. <laughs> Guess what? She gonna get her man and come right back out. <laughs> yeah. We gonna buy some thanks, sponsor. <laughs> Thank her, you. Her appreciate ass, it. I got what I wanted. Her ass was in that fucking party. <laughs> okay. Having a good old time. Right. Trash. In front of him. <laughs> in front of him. He probably still was in there. She probably was like, hey, now we both in here. What? <laughs> now we both here. I care, man. I care. All right. So, um, also, okay. Now that we're all following each other. Now you put up these status updates, right? Mm-hmm. <laughs> these subliminal messages. <laughs> okay. I don't do that, man. That's trash. <laughs> when you're like, oh, he get on my nerves, so then you put up those song lyrics. I don't need him. <laughs> I ain't never needed him. I-N-D-E-P-E. <laughs> Not I-N-D-E. -E. The whole song, huh? You put the whole, yes. the whole All verse. Of it. All <laughs> of it. All me. Wipe you, down. Yeah. <laughs> then you can scroll. Then he be out scrolling. Be like, oh, wait. What? You mad? <laughs> you mad? You know what, yo? I don't, I don't even feed into that shit, man. Because I'll be like, yo, you couldn't say this shit to my face. This shit don't mean nothing. Hmm. 
I don't even feed into that. I'll be, be laughing when I see when I see the subliminal post that girls sit up and like, <laughs> you mad or no? <laughs> Like, <laughs> like, 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 shit. oh, you mad or no? <laughs> She'd be like, oh, you independent now. Okay. <laughs> then she be like, oh, that wasn't even about you. <laughs> right, right, right. <laughs> Who child? It's the it's the, it's it's the ones that think they good dudes. You know what I'm saying? Hit you with some shit like that. Like, bitch, I know I'm a good dude. Like, <laughs> like. <laughs> I'm de- I'm definitely putting up subliminal posts, but it's not directed. It's actually more of a motivational minute. What I've learned or how I perceive the how I perceive the interaction that may have mm. caused the problem. Um, so it's not really like. Oh, I'm throwing all my business out there, but it's like, it may be like, this happened, so this is how I learned from it. Or, hey, this is what you could take from what I've been through. So it's not really, you no. might call it a subliminal post because the people who's reading it might assume that it's about them, okay. but it's okay. not necessarily, it might not necessarily be about them. It could be just... It's, it's, it's generalized. Yes, it's generalized, it's generalized, so you can learn from it. So it could be a learning experience. But it is about them, though. It's what you yeah. learn from. from. So they they, they, they may them. have they may have triggered the emotions, but my my understanding of the remote the emotions, my perception made it. And I'm I'm I'm, I'm about my business, so I'm not on there just being emotional, talking about oh this crazy all type of. I'm not doing that. I'm gonna create something that is gonna that everybody can take from it. I'm not just. And that's being, I'm not just being a child. And there you have media. it, everybody. The logic of men. <laughs> hey, yo. The logic of men. Hey, no, yeah. that, that's not logic. That's actually learning and understanding. Because mm-hmm. we don't, we men don't really want conflict. No. Nah. So to have conflict is like, like I'm trying to get other things done. So why are we even like, com- why are we conversing about this? Right. When we, when we could be focusing on something else, like yeah. it's more, it's it's more shit we can go into depth with. Like why we focus on the subliminal post or X, Y, and Z. Like all that shit is here and out the window. Like we could be focusing on some financial issues that we got. Like how the for fuck real. we gonna pay for so and so's uh, uh 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 private school education type shit? Like, how we gonna make this bag bigger? Right. That because as as a businessman. I have purpose for all my posts. So I'm not just posting just so I can. Yes. If you, when you touch people's emotions, you sell more like Mm. they're, they're emotional. They're emotionally invested in you. Right. But hence the podcast. you you don't, yeah, you don't, hence the podcast, but you don't want to, you don't want to make it too personal where your significant other is feeling like, damn, he just straight bashing me. You know what I'm saying? I'm, you know, it's not that serious. I, you don't need to right. be on social media bashing right. what like, you've been through with your, with your Absolutely. Shorty. Hey, like, if, if I'm going through some shit, you know what I'm saying, I might say something like, I might I might say something to the effect of, yo, if I'm triggered, don't trigger me. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I might say something like that. Niggas will read past that shit. Like, niggas be like, triggered? Fuck out of here. You know what I'm saying? Like, mm-hmm. the average person will read about it, but the person that is for it, like, you triggered? Fuck I do. You know what I'm right, saying? Right, right, right. And, and it, it has to be some understanding. It has to be don't just take the post for always for what is what it, what you think it says. Right. If you have if you have if you're if you're interested or you're and it touch you, shit. Just you got my phone number. You call might as well me. call me and ask me, babe, what you talking about? I, I felt have, some type of way. We should have had that conversation before you even posted on social media. Like I don't think you need to post on social media to have somebody give you that phone call and be like, hey. What was that about? What are you talking about? Are you talking about me? Like, if we have this open line of communication, this effective communication, mm-hmm. and a lot of the time that's that's not that's not what a, what's apparent. But right. go ahead, I'm listening. If we are, <laughs> if we have this open line of communication, when you put up this status, I need to already know what it was about. Mm-hmm. And you know, most of my statuses, my shorty already know what it's about. She, I, I done said it to her already. Okay. And we done right. we, for my motivational minutes. We done calculated how how this about to go, anyways. Well, see, that's what's up. Now, that's a mature way to handle it. That is but very some people mature. are putting it out there and be like, I'm going to say this, this, and this, and now he's going to call me. I'm going to wait. Yeah, that's that. I'm not doing that. I'm not, I'm <laughs> that's not, too I'm much not energy. calling your ass. I promise you I'm not. <laughs> I, I, and that sounds, <laughs> that sounds about right. I'm not calling your ass. So, no 
no matter if you're following them, they're following you, you're posting them, they're posting you, liking other people's pictures. You out here liking and commenting on other people's pictures. Now, now I have a I have a sub question to that. Is oh. it is it people that's obtainable? Because if I'm out here liking Cardi B pictures. You know, she ain't checking for my black ass. Attainable pe- people, yes, attainable people. Okay, I can I can see how that would be a problem. Um, you know, you liking obtainable people's pictures, um, especially if you don't have like a friendship relationship with that person. I can see how it can be a problem because it's like, it's like the, it's like the question is he fucking her? But I mean, you gotta you gotta have that you you gotta have that foundation before. True. Before everything, like you got to have that? that solid foundation of, you know, I'm with you, you with me and ain't nothing going on in between. Like if I like this girl picture, like just if I feel like she looked good in that picture and I follow her and I like it, like so be it. But if I don't follow her and I go to her page and like her picture, that's a whole different story. But if I if I already follow her into the relationship and you see that I like her picture, like it, it you know, she we was have- here before you. And she's gonna be not, after not, you. Not like that. <laughs> I don't care when she was there. <laughs> if you and me stop liking her bitches. So So how are we supposed to know when 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 is when it's not acceptable to like pictures? Like, like, okay, so like why is it so hard to not like their pictures? Like, why you can't just I, scroll if, past it? If I'm on Instagram and I see some shit, oh shit, the dress kind of cute on her, like, you know, like, and I keep it moving. Like, I would expect niggas to, right. I, you know what? I would, I would expect the chick to be That's like, like you walking past somebody, a cute guy, right, and you with your boo, and you give him a glance, like, oh, he kind of cute in your head. You like, oh, he kind of cute, but but I you keep it moving. I tap, double tap his shoulder. No, you All didn't. Right, so you doing, but you doing what if, the what if, at this point. <laughs> <laughs> what if you look and he look, but there's no real. I feel like that's what the like button is like. Is you you walking down the street with your boo and like, oh, you like something about that person, but it's not to the point where I'm gonna go out my way to show him that, show him attention. That's okay, so what if I like six pictures in a row? See, that's, that's a trash. different story. <laughs> that's true. That's, that's all the way out the way. Yeah. <laughs> you actually out of line. But what if he just been posting a lot? See, see, that you, mean you went to his, that means you liked the first picture, no, clicked on his name, not, went to his page, and then went to his fucking drop no. shit and like, 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 you, in you, my you timeline, he walked past me three or four times. That's the hell no. The oh, so rhythm, the algorithm don't fucking work that way. <laughs> you try to pull that wool over my goddamn eyes. The algorithm so, don't work that way. So he wanted Joe attention too. I, I and he got it. At least hey, don't make it. Yeah. Oh, okay. Instagram wanted him to have my attention because no, he keeps showing up. No, but the up. algorithm don't work that way. You not gonna see. Um, if you if you scroll past your timeline in one sitting, you're not going to see the same picture, the same person post more than twice. That's not how the algorithm well, works. Because right. I don't have 10k followers <laughs> and I don't follow 10k people. Oh my god! Um, I don't I don't follow 10k people. Sometimes I barely I follow a thousand. The, I do see the same person if they if they're out here posting back to back. Like if I got the I drinks mean, in me going back to back. Oh, right, I'm listening. <laughs> Here we go. Okay, <laughs> but if if I were to post, because now Instagram has that feature where you can post like several in one post and you mm-hmm. just keep swiping. But before they didn't have that. Mm-hmm. So if I still want to post that same amount of pictures, I have mm-hmm. to post and then post and then post. Okay, so we're talking about now though. Even mm-hmm. now, because like I said, my pictures like- I'm sorry to interrupt you, but I'm not liking three pictures at, in a row. <laughs> You not uh, like three your first, months? your first picture got my attention. You cute. All right, I'm past that now. What's <laughs> okay. next? Okay. Cause don't post the same picture, the same outfit, just three different poses. I don't want. I might like the best pose, but I'm not liking all three of your pictures. Oh, I'm so sorry. you didn't? Oh, you didn't scroll back up and see which which pose was the best? No. <laughs> oh, okay. I, I so you just scroll, like the first one. <laughs> that wasn't. That wasn't. That ain't hit me no way. I scrolled <laughs> again. Oh, yep. That what. Oh, that, that's the best picture. That's the one you should have posted. You should have deleted those last two and just posted that one. Because that would have got the most likes. Because sometimes all of them are good. Like sometimes To you, though. To you. <laughs> your likes don't say that. 
I'm just saying. All of all of my pictures are good. So I love it when I take 20 pictures and I don't have to piss, pick the best out of 20. Like, I love it when I take 20 pictures and all 20 of them good, you get all 20. Oh, you shit. Get all 20 because I was fine 20 times in a row. And that don't happen every day. I was fine so, 20 times so in a row. Do you get somebody that's going to like all 20? Yes. I want him to like all 20. Thank okay. you. I, I appreciate that. you. I'll slide in your DMs. I might like Whoever she five. talking Talk to, to <laughs> She coming Talk to me Like I'll sign your DMs So 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 when she you posted sliding. Them two pictures From the other day That was it What No I mean no That one all the cute ones Oh I put some on Instagram And then I put some on Facebook Oh okay Cause I gotta give You know I gotta give Different perspectives Cause I got different Followers on each oh. She just wanna paint A better picture <laughs> One size One size she had the yams out The other one she didn't So Right. Remember, she got family and friends on Facebook, so right. she can't be too provocative. Exactly. So on, on Facebook, I'm giving y'all the like, I'm cute today, and this is like what y'all like. But when I give it to them on Instagram, though, <laughs> get at me. <laughs> Don't make those faces at me. I didn't make them at you. I just made the face. <laughs> you got it. <laughs> what does that mean? What are you trying to say? What does your face mean? Explain. We don't. We can't hear faces on the podcast. Please no, let us know no, what we, you're thinking. No, we, we can move on. We can move on <laughs> to the next topic. Nah, I love but, you as a co-host. <laughs> <laughs> Let's just you leave it there. Say my pictures ain't cute. No, I'm cute. I, I didn't, I I'm didn't cute. say your pictures were on cute. I'm cute 20 pictures in a row. No, I like your picture. Like, what the hell? You did. You ain't liked them on Facebook yet, though. I ain't seen you on Facebook yet. Track, you don't pop up on my timeline, nigga. I'm not, not searching for. Tra- I'm not searching for my co-host. Like, let me see what the fuck she hitting with with the fit. Like, yes. yo. Yeah, you need to. You supposed to be boosted. Be. I'm your co-host. <sighs> I'm not checking for you on Facebook. If it pop up, I will like it. If the algorithm chooses not so, like <laughs> right? You need more of his pictures. No more. You know, like, I don't post that much. When the last time I posted a picture on my on my Instagram or on my Facebook? I'm, I'm crazy to you. Oh, okay. Mm-hmm. You show up in my yeah, algorithm. Because okay. I ain't posting shit. Anywho, okay, so liking other people's pictures is okay. It's okay if you... So we should be asking you that, though. Yeah, you're, right. you're a woman. Right, because okay. it be the women that be having the issue with the shit. The guys be cool. Yeah. Now, if you if you liking too many in a in a row, now that's a problem. But we give you a like or two. Yeah, like, I I'm okay with liking. It's the commenting. Like, why are you trying to talk to her? What you trying to say? But also, there are guys that like the pictures and then they comment in the DMs. So I don't. I, I don't. I'm definitely that guy. <laughs> I am definitely that guy. I will hit you with a DM comment like, "Hey, yo, <laughs> what's nah, popping for the night, though?" I, look, I, I, I ain't hitting you where everybody can see it. I'm hitting you with the, with the yo, like these other niggas out here thirsty in your comments, hitting you with the hard eyes and shit. Look, you dressed up. Where are you and your girls about to go? Because me and my niggas on the way. Hmm. What? What's more? He thirsty? stay with some plans, don't he? He always got plans. He now he trying to follow you on the plans. I don't know, but um, it's a whole new level of plans. Like if I know if look if, if look if I know she's single and I know her friends is if if her if she got friends and I know her friends is bad and me and my boys looking for something to do tonight just happen to scroll past like yo yo bro she be getting ready to go out. I know her friend's bad. Bro, you trying to roll? Yeah, nigga, I'm trying to roll. She... You're definitely with the she. <laughs> she... Can we all go? <laughs> right. Scroll pass. No, no, it, ain't no, no sc- it ain't no scroll pass. It ain't no scroll pass. Look, everybody looking to have a good time. Who's to say if I don't if, if I don't hit it off with Shorty, one of my boys ain't going to hit it off with one of her friends. I'm matchmaking. I'm matchmaking right okay. now. Blind date matchmaking. In her DMs. In her DMs. But I thought you don't slide in their DMs. So you do slide in their DMs? I feel <laughs> like you just contradicted yourself. So which, oh, which are you doing? So okay. now you're sliding in their DMs. Okay. This is like the one-off chance that I actually see somebody that I'm, I'm you know, I'm, I'm older now. This is when I was younger. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm not doing that shit now. Too old for that shit, man. You don't say what's up to me. I'm chilling. I'm at the house. On this couch. Sleep. <laughs> All right. Whatever you say. All right. So I guess that's what we feel about social media. I mean, I don't, is there anything else y'all want to bring up about social media? Any other ways y'all feel? 
Hmm. No. Uh, Kimon, where, where you at, man? Your hearts and minds clear, bro? In my heart uh-huh. and mind? Yeah. Definitely. Definitely clear? <laughs> Definitely. Um, you know, social media just can be a little complicated, but it has to be some understanding with social media. Uh, okay. If you're 18 to 21, you just using social media just because it's the thing to do. Yeah. This is, you don't really have a life. Your life is really on social, social media. media. You're going to be a comedian. You're going to be a jerk. You're going to be a womanizer, a manizer, if that even if that's even a word, on social media. But that might not be you on in real life. Right. So with I'm me, I'm an asshole I, on social media, but I'm not an asshole in real life. You know, and you're yeah, you're doing what entertaining people. <laughs> so, <laughs> yes, you're entertaining people. Yeah, you're doing what's what's entertaining to people. I guess it's talking. We're gonna we're gonna have a conversation okay. when we we're off air. Conversation. Yeah. I'm okay. With that. okay. I don't know what's going on, but between these two. <laughs> but uh, are y'all witnessing what I'm witnessing? I don't know. Me and her are gonna have a side conversation <laughs> when we get off camera. Offline. But. Yeah, facts, you, gotta, facts, facts. you gotta have. If you're using social media just to be social, you gotta have the understanding what your significant other as well. That I'm being social. I'm being. I don't really have any friends. I'm a popular loner, so this is who like, I am on social media. Popular loner. I like that term. <laughs> I like that term. Popular loner. So, you know, we got or new, new aliases. Yeah, I like that, Kiwan. I like that. Thank you. Thank you. Use that. I am, you know, I am gonna use it. Thank you, sir. Thank you for giving me that 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 jewel. You know, and if you if longer. it's if it's a business, if you're conducting, if you're using social media as a tool that it should be used for to network right. and to do business, it should be an understanding from your significant other that I'm doing this. This is for business. This is to bring in money. This is not just to scroll and pass time. Right, right, right. Absolutely, man. And you know, with with social media, man, like you have to be mature with the shit, man. Like you cannot be, you know, we're not in high school no mm-hmm. more, man. You know, we're, we're not in college no more. And you know unfortunately, it, it, with social media, the lines have been blurred from an adult to a child. Right. Because right. you can be on social media with your moms and your grandmoms. But in real life, you're not even engaging in their conversations because you're going to stay in a child's place. Right. And those places, those those lines have been blurred that shit. It seemed like everybody's a child on social media because nobody right. really had nobody. If you're if you're not conducting business, you're you're just con- playing. You're yeah. going outside and you're going to play on the playground. And if somebody smack you in the face, you're going to throw another little blow. Right, right, right. Feel me? So and, that, and that's facts. And that's facts, man. And, you know. If you're going if you're going to be in a relationship and be on social media man just just be mature about the shit man mm-hmm. like you know before you flip up and flip out just have a conversation man because it's like that's what we don't do as a uh as a generation we 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 don't have that we don't have effective communication mm-hmm. that's what we're lacking that's why we're always failing in relationships that's why we're always um you know, moving from one person to the next because we don't have effective communication. We sometimes you just you just have to sit down and have a conversation. You might not like what the other person is saying, and that's cool because the truth that's, hurts. Not even the truth hurts. That's their perspective. That's their truth. True. That's their perspective. That's their truth. So you got either you're gonna live with their truth because you want to be with them, or you gonna go somewhere else. Mm-hmm. One of the two. Understanding you know? way, bro. Understanding. That's, that's this is that's what I've been preaching this whole time, man. What I've been preaching this whole time. Y'all please listen to me, brothers. Brothers, <laughs> out, there. State face, <laughs> brothers out there, please listen to me, man. It's understanding, man. It's you might not understand everything your girl says. Brothers, get out your emotions too. Uh-oh. Like it's it's okay to Uh-oh. feel some type of way. But you have to conduct yourself in a manly manner. And don't be a Drake. Yeah, don't be a <laughs> if you want look, if you want to soak for three days, you got that. But once you come to your senses. You got to you got to have some understanding of all right this is only social media this is not real life yeah let's let's clear the air because I don't have to be I don't have to be mad or upset because somebody posted something yeah mm-hmm. is there is their social media and ultimately they have the control of their social media right so That's if y'all if you can't handle it get out the kitchen yeah absolutely i'm with it i have no reason saying peace like oh yeah 
out of here. <laughs> Vita, is is your heart and mind clear now? Um, yes. I have I have been given a new perspective today mm-hmm. as a as a woman mm-hmm. because we do like to be like we do want to be your WCW. But I understand if you're using it as business, especially if you're doing right in real life. Mm-hmm. Right. right. I'm good. Because that's what matters. And that's you know, what matters all day, every day. Even on the business tip, you can you you definitely oh. should show your woman off. Oh. oh we got- on a business tip. Like you definitely I, you don't gotta go crazy with it. Right. But you know, pe- oh. the people should know that I, I I am with somebody. I am show respect. That's at, respect. Exactly. That's right. respect. And I can understand where you're coming from, like, you know. I mean, shoot, your lady came in here with the with the with the shirt on, mm-hmm. so it's like, yo, it is what it is. Like, yo, right. they rock, they rocking the shirt. Like, yo, we we in here, you know what I'm saying? Like, business way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, oh, yeah, I, I understand absolutely. that. I understand oh, that. I understand you that. Need to boost your significant other, absolutely. Even I, if they know, look, that. I'm never against that. Absolutely, I'm with it. I'm all. I'm here for it. I'm never against that. I'm with it. All right. Well, all hearts and minds clear. Is, yeah. is your heart and mind clear? Ash? Oh, absolutely, bro. I spoke my piece. Baby, I'm, God, baby, look, I'm here. I'm here, man. I'm here. I'm here. So, Kiwan, let them know where they can follow you on social media. Shout out your business and all that good stuff. And post a brand, IG, and Facebook. Uh, Kiwan Huff, my personal page on Facebook, if y'all want to follow me there. I don't follow many people on my and post a brand page just because I don't want to be bombarded by y'all information. I will follow y'all on my personal Instagram page so we can have fun and do whatever. All right, facts, facts. And you can follow me, uh, King Bot, K V N G B A K, all one word, Instagram and Twitter. Um, make sure you follow the podcast, D N D, letter D, letter N, the letter D pod uh, on Instagram. Uh, you can follow Miss V at N Fragile underscore Phoenix um, on Instagram. Because she don't got shit else. But we're about to get out of here. You know what I'm saying? Uh, peace. Peace. Wake up and earn something. <laughs>